Reload, reload, reload. Bear hunt. We're gonna go look for blood, see if he hit him. It's been about 20 minutes. It's right here. There he is, Nick. He's right there. Didn't even go. Walk up to him real slow. Not. Congratulations, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, just come this way. Listen, he might be sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> like really, dude. <laughs> he ain't sleeping. It wasn't a joke on camera. I mean, fucking guy. I'd be like, wait till he gets real close. <laughs> what did I tell you? Those ballistic tips. Yes, sir. Congratulations, Nick. Thanks, buddy. Good looking little bear, isn't he? Beautiful looking bear. Still got a good coat on him. Never been rubbed at all. So we're up in uh, Fern Valley, Fern Gully. Came in around 4 o'clock, 4.30. It was real hot, so the flies weren't a problem then. Set up a, set up a blind about 70 yards away from the bait. Tyson, the guide, he was saying, Saying it was getting hit pretty, uh, pretty hard almost every night, so had a really good feeling about it, and uh, just kind of sat back and stayed quiet there for a couple hours. Not a sound, just came out of the woods, big black shadow, and uh, you know, kind of caught us by surprise. It was early; it was only you know, just before eight, and uh, it took some, uh, took some food from the bait barrel there. After knocking it down, ran back in the woods. You know, we set up. Not a minute later, came back in. We had to wait till it uh, stuck its head up from the bait barrel. And, uh, when it did, I popped it. I wasn't even sure if I had hit it. It stumbled when it ran off. But you know, Tyson was. Tyson would put money on it that it hadn't gone too far there. I wasn't so sure until we walked about 20 minutes later there. Walked about 35 feet away from the uh, the barrel, five feet into the bush, and here he is. He didn't. He was. You know, he was dead before he started running. So pretty excited. Very first black bear. And uh, ballistic tip, you know, I I didn't want the bear going too far, so I let you pick the uh, <laughs> pick the ammunition. You know, so this will drop a bear, and hey, can't say you're too far off. Post. Didn't drop it at the barrel, but he didn't make it very far—35, 40 feet yep. at most. And thank you much to Tyson McFarland for setting it up, and bringing me out. Fantastic! This guy's gonna make a good rug and a good meal. There's <laughs> the barrel. Blind. There's the bear and the happy hunter. Yep. New Brunswick. Thick with flies, thick with bears. <laughs> <laughs>